The overall purpose of IRT is to provide uh, a joint mission between the Army, Navy, Air Force, and the Marines. But the number one thing is training. The other piece is just providing no-cost uh, health care to the community. Uh, so it's essentially like it's a humanitarian mission. So there are multiple IRTs that take place from civil engineering to medical. Georgia is medical this month and Kentucky will be the next location for it in July. So we do multiple IRTs throughout the year. No, um, you know, for us, so. okay. Free, free yourself, right? okay. Okay. We're actually providing a service that most people in this community either they don't have access to or maybe they may not have the resources to, um, to, to pay for. It's really hard to describe how much we appreciate it um, because we only have two part-time doctors. Uh, we have 8,500 people. There's a really great need for medical services here. They are allowed to see either dental or optometry, but they are always able to see medical or mental health. We are checking vision, interocular pressures. We're getting their preliminary readings with an uh, autorefract, and at the end of this, they'll be getting a, at no cost, pair of frames. Full time, I work in an optometry clinic with the VA. I already work with veterans. I really enjoy IRTs because it can help me give back to the community. I mean, we've had people shed tears. It's, it's a really wholesome experience. So a lot of our patients in this community had to travel a long way, relatively uh, a long way, you know, to get here. And at some point you have to realize that what we're doing is extremely important. Day one we had one patient, day two was 26 patients, then it shot up to 49 patients, then 48 patients, then it jumped all the way up to 64 patients. The total cost of healthcare is over $120,000 in less than two weeks, you know, that we've saved the, the county, that we've offered at no cost to, to the community. People eventually get hearing aids due to conductive hearing loss. The military does care. Um, if you just look at the messages on the wall and they are in every hall, uh, you can see how much they're appreciated. Very much appreciated. Um, everybody says how nice they are, how professional they are. And that course comes with the military presence, you know, but uh, I'm very thankful. We want to present this to the staff, you know, here for all that you've done, you know, for us and making this.